Mamadou Wad Diop, who calls himself Dr. Drone on social media, is one of the few people, if not the only person, in the Dakar area who can fix broken drones. But recently, he's taken his knowledge a step further, consulting with drone makers across the world via the internet on how to construct one of his own. For example, I've spoken with Chinese and French people about their experiences designing and creating drones. While Wad does a lot of work in the audiovisual sector, renting his services out to news and documentary crews, the purpose of his first Made in Senegal drone will be the health sector. It will spread chemicals to prevent mosquito breeding in stagnant water. This is the prototype of my Made in Senegal drone, so it's a quadricopter. We haven't finished putting it together yet, so it has four helices and it can carry 15 kilograms, which means it can hold a reservoir of 10 liters. This drone will be used in the health sector, pulverizing mosquito breeding areas in the preventative fight against malaria. Though not all materials necessary to make the drone are available in Senegal, Job says he wants to prove that it's possible to build one in his home country. We can't find this carbon fiber in Senegal, so I ordered it from China. But we formed the pieces here with the help of local blacksmiths who have helped me make what I want. This piece we took from a broken refrigerator. While the demand for drones is not high in Senegal, it is growing. There is a demand, but there's not yet enough drones or knowledge about the subject here. There is Wade, there are a few others. So the demand is here, but there's not yet enough material to meet it. If we don't start developing this technology here and now, others will come in and sell it for us for much higher prices. So we're uniquely positioned right now in Senegal and the wider region to conceive these drones. And Wad is confident that he can fulfill his country's demands for drones as it continues to develop. Isha Sarai, VOA News, Mbour, Senegal.